guys, what is up, PI Podcast here, and today I got this first off the line limited football 2022. Um, I got this off of Panini's website. Um, at the low, at the lowest it possibly went out, I got it. So I got a box. Um, it is a little late. I do have Panini containers first off the line open too. Um, they're a little late, so you guys will see this on my birthday i'm probably gonna edit it tonight but as you're seeing this i'm recording this on my birthday so a little birthday rip with limited um so yeah definitely excited for this uh 2022 panini limited football first of the line box you get one you get two autos and one men one being one holographic spotlight rookie patch auto one relic one holographic spotlight base parallel and one 2004 limited tribute insert so that's the the holographic spotlight rookie patch auto and the base parallel and the 2004 limited tribute insert is the exclusive in the first supply box. So, uh, let me go ahead and get this open. So, uh, we can look at the back for a second. Might have to use a pen today because I lost my uh, box cutters. Um, if my nail doesn't do the trick, and it did. Alright, the seal is broken. I've been sitting on this for a minute. I've been just looking at it dying to open this and I finally get a chance to open it no going back now it is open unsealed got that first up line sticker here which is really nice and on the back you can find base silver spotlights sapphire spotlights number one limited memberships uh, dynamic duos number one draft day signature booklets partnership duels booklets Limited edition 2004 limited tribute rookies, uh, which we're gonna get one for because first of line. Um, so yeah, um, this is gonna be a fun rip, I bet. I'm uh, definitely excited for this. Uh, yeah, I'm super excited. I think it's gonna be really, really fun. Put this off to the side. Um, I'm gonna move my thing over there so I don't have to worry about it. He's not moving. That's okay. All right, so let's just get these packs out. That one seems very thin. But all of these seem very thin. So I don't even know what to expect. I'm just gonna go like this. That is a box of presentation. It's pretty nice too. So we're gonna put the box to the side. I got three packs to open. Ah, oh, this looks nice. Looks nice. I think there's a little dust on it, but it is what it is. All right. Let's open this bad boy up and bing yep, okay. Alright, this one feels like the package it feels if I don't know. But it is backwards, I guess. I guess we'll go like this, but we'll go like this, I think. I think I know how to. Yeah, these are the base cards. Uh, we got Stefan Diggs. That might be our holographics parallel base. 22 out of 22, Stefan Diggs. That's actually pretty nice. Uh, Stefan Diggs, 22 out of 22. Um, I think it should fit in a regular card sleeve. 22 out of 22, Stefan Diggs. That's nice. Like, if, if anything, you want a good bet. And Stefan Diggs is a good bet. 22 out of 22. That is nice. And then you got Dak Prescott on the base. He's back. And then my boy Kyle Pitts on the base card as well. Uh, I am a Falcons fan, so all these, uh, all Falcons are PC for me. So uh, I will never get rid of any Falcons cards unless it does go for a lot. But even then, I probably wouldn't. I caught pits right there for my collection. Uh, and then we got Derrick Henry. And might have our... Pa it's a huge patch too. Unlimited potential patch of Matt Corral. 52 out of 125. Matt Corral patch. Huge patch right here too. It's going to say not from any specific game event. Yep. Not from any specific game or event. Unfortunately. Man, let me know what you guys think about that. I don't, 
I obviously don't like it. A, a lot of people don't either, but that's what Panini does sometimes. Um, there's a patch, Matt Corral. I think Matt Corral is going to be... Uh, I want to see him play. Uh, he didn't even get a chance, but he might not again in Carolina because they have the number one overall pick now. Um, and the Carolina Panthers might t select CJ Stroud. So I'm going to open this pack first. That pack felt really thick. Felt really thick. It might be our RPA. So I'll leave the best for last. I'm going to open this as best we can. Um, we should have our auto behind this one. Yeah, so we're going to leave that to the side. And we got another Kyle Pitts out of 99. 65 out of 99 Kyle Pitts on a holographic again. We're only supposed to get one holographic, um, but I guess they gave me an extra one? Or there's another one in it? Um, no, I think they gave me an extra one, so I'll take it. And it's Kyle Pitts, so that's that's definitely okay with me. Definitely chill with Kyle Pitts being my 65 and that numbered parallel holographic. That's actually pretty sick. I like this card a lot. Two Kyle Pitts. And then our other bases were Jarvis Landry and Michael Parsons. We opened a 2021 Limited last year and we got a Richie Grant RPA, which was nice for my PC. Um, and we got some other autos. I don't think anything too crazy. And then we got George Kittle here. And then we got a Passport USA Redskins membership of Brian Arakpo. 5 out of 25. That's actually an interesting auto to get. Brian Arakpo. Hell of a defensive player for the Redskins when they were called the Redskins. Um, but five out of twenty-five on the auto. This might be an. This is an on. It's an on-card auto too. That's actually really cool. Five out of twenty-five, Brian Arakpo. That's actually pretty sick. I do really like that. I look. It's it's Brian Arakpo. Brian Arakpo was an amazing player for the Redskins and awesome player to watch um, when he played. So it's really cool to get his auto. Alrighty guys, sorry about that. My phone ran out of storage. I have so many videos I need to, as you can, as you know, we've been having so many throwback videos of past, last year's product. Um, I still need to upload product from this year or from earlier. It's all on my phone, so limited. So if you see a cut, yeah, I had to delete some storage off my phone. But Brian Arakpo is really interesting. Five out of 25. That's a really interesting auto. And now our last pack should be our holographic. Some touches are falling like crazy now. Especially, especially, I guess. Our holographic our RPA should be in here. So, hopefully it's a good one. Like, I mean, it's, so far this box has been pretty good. We got two holographics when we were only supposed to get one. Um, Kyle Pitts numbered. I'm having trouble opening this pack as you can see. So let's open this. I'm super excited to open this. This is actually a really cool product. Alright. So it's gonna be and our RPA is literally gonna be I don't even know what that is. Alright. So this is our limited tribute insert. It's Cole Turner. Um not the guy you want. Uh, obviously and then we also got a Justin Fields pretty cool and then another base Stefan Diggs <laughs> um, and then our last base Deontay Johnson and last but not least we got a oh this is going to be Isaiah Spiller I think Isaiah Spiller on the holographic unfortunately 13 out of 29 cool three color patch. it's actually a really cool three color patch oh man this guy I've pulled before and that is not the guy you want on the 13 or 29 it's not the guy you want Isaiah Spiller for the Chargers oh man that is not who I expecting as my RPA for limited dang it is a cool looking card though 
patch is cool. It's actually feels really good too. Three color patch, I, I can't complain. Um, yeah, not from any specific gamer event again. Isaiah Spiller, there you go. Oh, I'm gonna get to sleep out. We'll do a quick recap. Uh, I definitely, that's not the guy I was wanting at all in this product. Oh man. All right, so Isaiah Spiller, here we go. All right, so for the hits, I'm too crazy today. We got out of 13 was our first off the line exclusive 13 out of 29 holographic Isaiah Spiller RPA. Yikes. Got a really cool other auto, which isn't guaranteed. Like, uh, well, auto is guaranteed, but like a really cool defensive player auto. Five out of 25 Brian Arakbo. I actually really like that. And then our patch was Matt Corral, 52 out of 125. And we ended up getting two holographic base parallels, which you're only supposed to get one, so I get extra. Uh, 65 out of 99 on Kyle Pitts, I'll take that. And 22 out of 22, Stefan Diggs. Uh, so, I'm not too mad about this box. Pretty cool defensive auto, Kyle Pitts numbered. Um, I'll take that all day. And uh, Isaiah Spiller, unfortunately, is our RPA. Could have been anyone else, and I've been happy. I've been trying to find Drake Hunter and Desmond Ritter. I haven't pulled them all at all this year, except for in 2022 Cle Chronicles draft picks. I only pulled the Ritter, and then after that, I haven't pulled anybody except Tyler Algier and that product too. I haven't pulled any Desmond Ritter, Drake London in their college uni, in their Falcons uni. So I really want to look for that. Fortunately, not today. Uh, but thank you guys so much for watching this video. Leave a like, subscribe if you're new to the channel, um, and uh, we'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Thank you for watching the PI Podcast. Make sure you subscribe and tune in next time so you don't miss the latest news in the NFL world. You can also follow us on TikTok at PI Podcast and on Twitter at PI Podcasters. Until next time.